In today's video, I'm going to prove the why you probably don't need to be good at math to be a programmer. Today, I watched a video from a channel I watch often called Mind Your Decisions. Mind Your Decisions shows logic and math puzzles that are sometimes way over my head, but I still like to see how they come to the solution. Today's problem is you have a five digit number. Each digit is a number zero through nine. A, B, C, D, E times 4 equals D, D, C, B, A. Before I watched the math way, I wrote a short program in C Sharp in about 10 lines of code. I will put a link in the video description to the Mind Your Decisions video if you want to see the way they solve it. Here is the source code for the button click. I will briefly explain how the code works. Even if you are not a programmer, I am sure you can follow along. First, I declare a local Boolean variable called solution found and set its value to false. Then I start a for loop and iterate from 10,000 to 25,000. For each number between 10,000 and 25,000, I create a string called temp from the number x. I then multiply x times 4. Then create a string, temp2. From the result of the multiplication, I then reverse the string and use a C-sharp method called string.concat, which adds the characters from the reverse method. And finally, I check if the string temp2 and temp3 are equal. If they are a match, I set solution found to true, and I show a message box with the solution and exit the for loop. At the end of the button click event, if a solution was not found, I show another message box explaining it is not solvable. Now I am going to run the program. Pause the video if you want to try the problem yourself, or go watch the way Mind Your Decisions solves the problem. Okay, I am now going to run the program. As you can see, the answer is 2, 1, 9, 7, 8. Checking that in a calculator, multiplying by 4, and the result is eight, seven, nine, one, two. Thanks for watching.